right here, you'll start to see some kids are running away from what uh, turns out to be a, I mean, two or three kids fighting, and it turns out to be probably about four or five more involved. I think uh, some of them are trying to pull, pull the two or three uh, off each other. LMPD received reports of two fights Saturday on a day where hundreds of people took advantage of the Big Four Bridge. One of the fights was on the bridge and the second at the bottom of the bridge. Videos from that night show the increased police presence surrounding the large crowd. At least 17 officers were on the ground that night, including a few from the 9th Mobile Division. Unfortunate incident to have anytime you have crowds and Anytime you'd have kids, particularly small kids. Tim Childers was there. He recorded cell phone video showing some of the police activity. He says he did not feel safe. So my concern is that this is becoming the norm and uh, there's no consequences for these kids. If this is a Saturday night and it's nice weather and this happens, what about when there's an event? And there's 20,000 people here. Sergeant Phil Russell says people should feel safe visiting the Big Four Bridge. He thinks the officers handle the situation appropriately. It's a large venue. I mean, and, and you're going to have thousands of people down there, particularly when the weather's nice. And so we're going to uh, staff appropriately. And we're always looking at, you know, our, our, can we do better? You know, and, and, and I think even in this instance, we'll look at it. Russell says no injuries were reported and no arrests were made. What we want to convey uh, to our citizens that if you want to come down there, certainly their security, we're there. We will handle anything that happens uh, if it needs a police presence. But obviously everyone has a right uh, to the park and we want to ensure that everybody when they go that they're safe.